Bowman here at BW1.com. I'm going to show you a quick Windows 7 tip here, Windows XP mode. Windows XP mode is a pretty cool feature that's even included in Windows 7. It basically allows you to run a virtual version of Windows XP for those applications that don't quite yet run in Windows 7. So if you're worried about upgrading because you might have some compatibility issues and you're still on Windows XP, you can actually use this to actually run a virtual version of Windows XP right within Windows 7 and keep your application compatibility, which is pretty cool. It's included in Windows 7, but the first thing you actually have have to do is you actually have to go to Microsoft and download the two files. It'll show you which files you need to download and how to install them. Once you've done that, the next thing you need to do is you need to go down here to your start orb, go into all programs, go into Windows Virtual PC, and you want to click on Windows XP mode. It'll start up the virtual machine here, then instantly you're right into a virtual version of Windows XP as you can see here. And uh, it'll, run, it'll run just like um, just like if it was on your desktop, like on a separate computer. If you go to my computer, it'll actually map all your drives that are in the Windows 7 environment, so you can access those files there too. Um, it'll run just like Windows XP, you can update it, you can put you know different programs you you know you can do everything you want to right within here as a virtual version of Windows XP it is uh really good to use and let's say you know you want to get on the internet you can jump right on the internet go to internet explorer if you want to you can install firefox or whatever browser you want to in there and um just to do an example of an application i downloaded an img burn as you can see there, it runs right within the Windows uh, XP environment. I'm pretty sure that's, I think that's compatible with Windows 7, but just in case it's not, you can run it in Windows XP mode right here. And you can actually run everything in there like Windows XP basically right within there. Now let's say uh, you don't want to open up this whole thing here. We can just close out and it'll hibernate the virtual machine. And let's say you just want to run just one particular application and you know it has compatibility issues. You can actually go into all programs virtual PC and you see down here it says Windows XP mode applications IMG burn is one that we installed and you want to go IMG burn Windows XP mode you want to click on that it'll launch the application it'll actually yep we want to click continue to close out of that I'll ask you that question real quickly and then it'll actually run like it's in Windows XP right on Windows 7 without you even being the virtual machine as you can see here you can see that it has the Windows XP um, toolbars and taskbars at the top there and has all the Windows XP colors and stuff which is pretty cool so it runs right within there it doesn't run it you know it's a little slow as far as the uh, graphics are concerned since it's running virtually but now you can run the application native to it and it doesn't take you out of the Windows 7 look but it r runs because it's using a virtual version of XP in the background to get the application running so that's pretty cool just want to show you that real quick I think it's a very valuable uh, application there for those of you that are still on Windows XP and you really want to upgrade but you're just hanging on to an application because it's only compatible with Windows XP now you can see you can run that in Windows 7 fine and you can enjoy the new features of Windows 7 and upgrade so this is Bowman from BW1.com giving you XP mode a Windows 7 tip giving you Windows XP mode here reminding you to follow us on Twitter subscribe to our RSS feed subscribe to our YouTube page check us out on Ustream and always remember live your tech world high definition